Hello guys, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can use a chat GPT-4 for free. First, you need to head over to the website www.forefront.ai. Simply make an account, log in. Once you have done all those steps, you would land onto a page whose interface would look like this. Now over here, you can see we have some options to work with. In this down-headed arrow, you can see we have chat GPT-3.5, 4, Cloud 1.2 and Cloud 2. For the moment, let me stick to Cloud Instant 1.2. You can also use ChatGPT 3.5, ChatGPT 4 as well as Cloud 2 as well. But in the description right beneath ChatGPT 4, you can see it says upgrade to access premium models. And similarly, Cloud 2, it has the same description as well. But for our purpose, GPT 3.5 and cloud and cloud instant 1.2 is sufficient it would give you exactly the same benefits that can be obtained using chat gpt4 let me show you for example you can ask it to generate an image let me ask it to generate an image create an image of a dog cooking meal in the kitchen press enter and let's see what does it come up with and there you go you can see how beautiful this image is. It's been created by Cloud Instant. And now you can simply download it right from here. And there it is. You can see how realistic this image is. It has properly understood our prompt and generated an image, what we were looking for. Let me get back to the forefront. Let's go to new chat. And this time I'm going to click on chat with a document. Show all file. I'm gonna upload a document. I'm going to upload this particular research paper right into forefront.ai. Our file has been uploaded to the server. Now let me converse with the app to know what does this paper actually contains. Let me ask it, what's the summary of of this research paper please explain in few lines now press enter and there you can see it has actually read the paper and made a summary of the content of the paper that you can read now you don't need to go through the entire research paper to read everything to read all the contents understand the paragraphs understand the graphs get your head around the tables and spend at least two hours now you can do it simply in one minutes and there it is believe me it has done an excellent job in understanding this particular research paper and making a summary of it this can only be done using this particular application now let me show you one more feature this time i'm going to upload an image chat with image i'm going to upload this image and i don't know what this particular image is all about and there we have our image let me ask it what does it contain what does this image shows enter and there you go the image shows a close-up view of a rock cliff face showcasing its layered geological structure the cliff is composed of multiple distinct rock layers with each layer having different color texture and pattern. Look at this. It has beautifully explained this rock structure to us. It could be a complex image that you might find it hard to analyze. You can simply upload it over here and gets its content analyzed. Now let me show you some other features as well. Over here you can see chat with data. Unfortunately, I don't have enough data to explain this feature to you, but let me explain it a little bit. For example, you have done some experiments in the laboratory and you have gathered some data. For example, you have done some experiments on a drug that is going to be used as a treatment for cancer and you have generated a lot of data. Now you want to make a sense of that particular data. You simply need to upload your Excel file right over here and ask it what are the trends, what does the data indicate. It would beautifully explain everything to you. Now let me show you one more feature right over here and this is called workflow. Click over it. Now you can see this description shows workflows are reusable chat templates to automate tasks. Workflows can be used to generate long form blog posts, respond to support queries, write sales emails and much more. Let me show you. I'm going to create this workflow. You can actually watch this demo video as well to get a know how, how to use this new feature. You can actually start with a file. For example, you can upload a file and you can also start with a message as well. Let me click on message. I'm going to ask it make a lesson plan for first year class on chemistry about 
stoichiometry. Now click on this plus sign and add one more message. Write at least five questions on stoichiometry. Write an email to new students to submit their lab reports immediately now you can actually click on save click on save and save it as now you simply need to click on run this step it would do everything like this and similarly click on run this step it would immediately do what you have asked it and similarly you can run this step as well and there we are now you can simply save this workflow next time you can simply go right over here and it would immediately complete all these three steps this was simply a demo we need we simply need to give it our input and there you go it has a show inputs you simply need to give their inspect you can simply write from here edit the workflow change it and again it would do the same job for you as well let me save the workflow here you can see these are the files that we have just uploaded in the assistant you can actually make an assistant i'm not going to do this for you you can make an assistant for yourself like i have created an assistant for myself and you can also use these assistant as well for example marketing manager software engineer helpful assistant financial analyst let me show you this one software engineer click over it now you can ask this software engineer to write some code for you let me ask it write a code in html and css to make a simple calculator enter and there you go your assistant has immediately wrote an html and css code for your calculator now you can simply copy it and paste it into your code editor to check it whether it works or not and i'm sure it would work sometimes it does make mistakes but over it gives you beautiful results and you can also in the assistant make your own assistant as well for example it gives description what should the assistant know to provide better response i'm a software developer and only use python for data analysis here you can write your description what particular tasks you want your assistant to accomplish how would you like the assistant to respond when i ask you for code please just give me the code without any explanation on how it works similarly you can give the description based on what you want from your assistant and it would create an assistant for you i have already done you can see nur i actually ask it to do some chemistry tasks for me for example write two simple chemical equations equations for me enter and uh, there it is it has written these two chemical equations for me in this way you can actually customize your assistant in a way so that it gives you the best productivity finally let me show you currently i am a free plan but you can upgrade it right from here as well this is basic nine per month 29 dollar per month and 69 dollar per month in ultra case if you have to do a lot of tasks you have to analyze a lot of data then i would say go for basic check it if you find it useful enough for your kind of task then you can simply upgrade it otherwise i think this free plan is good enough so that is it for today's guide i hope you have found this tutorial useful please give it a thumbs up and thanks for watching